well good morning internets here we go we have ourselves a start to another day well it's supposed to be a little bit of a warmer day but uh, we'll get used to it while it is here because well winter is going to be winter eventually and yeah welcome to our vlog so here we go Well, of course, uh, last night was uh, what's become to be a normal night for me. Kind of uh, spent her dend up inside the house, doing uh, editings and getting videos ready um, for the uploadings for, well, into the New Year's. Um, it's kind of a constant, never-ending uh, struggle or battle or challenge to always make sure there's content uh, coming down the line as well as dealing with uh, issues going on in uh, your personal life and things like that. It's kind of weird how we as humans kind of become complacent with what is going on in our lives, kind of become used to the way things work or the way things are and don't want to change until it becomes a problem and then after it becomes a problem then we try to find a solution as an example with my doctor issues I know it's way way too early to say this new doctor is the best thing since sliced bread however uh, he's definitely made more progress in the month that I've seen him than my my doctor did in the 16 years that I've seen him I'm not sure why, but I guess it's like anything else. You know, automotive mechanics get overwhelmed with, uh, you know, with time. They get uh, outdated in medical knowledge. They kind of get uh, their edge lost on how to deal with patients. And um, end up kind of just coasting through until retirement. Well, with my old doctor... Uh, he came to me recommended from a co-worker because I kind of needed a doctor because my doctor had uh, moved on to bigger better things and 16 years ago I started out with this guy and well he was good in the beginning but then tapered on off so I am hoping that this new doctor uh, stays good at least until he fixes a few of the things that is wrong with me uh, or that has developed one of the biggest things um, that's going on right now is something that I can't really control. Is something that's been going on uh, when I think about it for probably five years or more. And uh, it's one of those things that affects everything. And uh, if, if, um, if there is a problem there, then it's a snowball effect for everything around and I most definitely show very very strong symptoms as well as tests for said item. I don't know why my previous doctor didn't test for it or if he did test for it did he not read the test correctly. Um, same with other things too that was going on that apparently has fixed itself uh, um, over the last you know four or five months. My other doctor was concerned about some high levels of something or other and apparently that there is no high levels of nothing in uh, the current blood work and my lifestyle hasn't changed. So I have no idea if they got my lab report mixed up with uh, somebody else or was he just following the uh, um, you know disease of the month club and trying to sell medication right? Some of the medication my old doctor had me on um, uh, no longer was recommended to treat that kind of condition or conditions. Um, there's better pills out now, cheaper pills out now, and easier ways to treat it with less side effects than what he was prescribing. So, like I said, the new doctor's done a lot. 
so hopefully we can carry through that momentum because well when I look at my life and look how much it's changed in the last few years and no matter what I do no matter what I try I can't physically get back to where I was and uh, it's like something was missing uh, something was missing that I couldn't physically get myself and uh, like I said no matter how much I tried it just was not there and I it's not like I was lazy it's not like I was sitting there with a bag of potato chips and you know watching TV all day it's just the way it was and my other doctor used to say about weight gain and all that stuff well um <laughs> I don't eat um, my food intake is very very minimal and but yet it was still going the opposite way and it all started uh, right around the time I broke my hand that may not have been you know the start of it that might have been a trigger or that might have been when I started noticing the big big change it might have started before then but ever since then ever since 2012 that was when things started to go downhill and then when the whole hand thing come along it went even further along than what it already had well today I would like to do some running around um, part two of my list um, or, or so I do one or two more things on there but pretty much guys gonna make me a hot beverage go check out the news for this morning by the time I'm done it should be daylight time to uh, get on going for the day and around well hello internets here we are well I got some running around done this morning uh, one or two things off of uh, the list of things to do so that's a bonus there I stopped by the backup uh, shoe store and like normal just like the last time I was in there as well they didn't even uh, carry that brand that I was looking for so I am thinking that I'm gonna have to either shop out of town or order it online um, sometimes times change you know things change and you can no longer find that brand of uh, shoes that I always have worn and unfortunately that's the way it goes you kind of got to change with it and find a new brand and uh, go with it maybe so I got a big big uh, road trip coming up again to the city um, probably in another month or so and uh, hopefully when I go up there maybe I can hunt down a store and uh, pick up a couple of pairs while I'm up there but uh, failing that you know always order them in online I'm pretty sure I'm pretty sure you can find them to order in well don't know how the day is gonna go uh, there is still a couple more items on the list that I would like to get done so the day is still young by far that uh, may or may not happen not really making any promises not really uh, uh, saying it's gonna happen but if it does it does if it doesn't well there's always tomorrow so gonna go in and do a few things and uh, probably see y'all later this afternoon well hello internet here we are well we come to the end of another day well it was a good day it was a uh, steadier day went out got my appointment over and done with which uh, most definitely was a plus hopefully we can uh, get some results uh, going here by early New Year's it'll be nice to be able to get back to where I uh, need to be because well quality life uh, means something and when quality life is not there then uh, well things tend to suffer right well did a couple things today uh, that I wanted to get done However, I didn't quite get the whole uh, list done, but well, that's what uh, there always is tomorrow about. We will try to tackle another two or three items tomorrow. 
as well as do some more uh, uploads for the vlogs get them uh, good to go and uh, well that will most definitely carry us through the new year and then uh, we'll be good to roll but pretty much guys remember we do have a fan mail box for all your fan mail needs address is down below if you write me I will write you back if you send me a decal I will send you one back uh, if you would like a decal sent to you please include a stamp and a uh, self-addressed envelope and I will mail you a decal back but as always thanks for watching Maxwell's vlogs Comment, subscribe, and enjoy.